everyone, Monroe Steele here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel and another vlog. Make sure to give a girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. All right, so we are preparing for New York Fashion Week in this vlog. I'm in Miami currently. I think I'm gonna be heading back to New York in about five days. I have a ton of things to do in New York. Some of them are Fashion Week related, some not, but we are preparing nonetheless. Um, and we are starting off with my first Coperni. Ah! If you follow me on Instagram, you saw a little teaser for this. Um, and this portion of the video is in partnership with none other than Farfetch. You guys know I've been working with Farfetch for a few years now. It is one of my favorite places to shop online um, for designer goods, for up and coming um, designers. I always, anything I'm looking for, I always find it on Farfetch because it is a conglomerate of boutiques all over the world where you can shop on one website. The shipping comes super quick. I think I ordered this and it came in two days from, I don't know, Germany maybe, like somewhere super far. Um, but yeah, I love their shipping, it's super quick. I probably have an updated code for you all. So I'll put all of the details here, I'll put the code on screen here, and I will put all of the terms and conditions down below in the description box. I'll also put a code in, the pin, in a pinned comment. So we're just gonna kick off this vlog with a bag unboxing. And this is unlike anything I have currently in my bag collection. So let's open it up. Well, it comes in this white box that says Caperni. Ah! Okay, so it has a little dust bag here. And it came like very well packaged so it's not dented or anything. Here is the dust bag. You guys. I love it. So these bags are so hot because the shape is very, very classic. I wanted something for New York Fashion Week and Paris Fashion Week that screams. I know how to style things. <laughs> and like this zebra print or black and white um, for some it's very hard to style um, and so I'm gonna style this up a few different ways um, in today's video so you guys can see um, how to style up a zebra print or a, a black and white print so this is the Caperni bag and I love her like the shape is perfect you can see how big it is next to my head it's not big Oh, and I love that the zipper goes like all the way around. It's so cool. So it has silver hardware. I just moved both of those zippers up and I open her like so. And she just has some paper in there. Let me take the paper out. This is a very structured bag. It will hold its shape. Um, but inside it's just fairly open. There are like no like little pockets or anything in there. Um, let's see if it fits my phone. I know it doesn't. Like I'm looking at it and I just know with all of my heart. I mean, you can fit it in like that, but not so much where you can close it. I have the iPhone 14 plus. Um, so yeah, this is not gonna fit your phone. At least this version isn't, but it's so cute. I love it. Oh, shout out to Farfetch for sending this over. Um, I'm gonna link a few of my favorite Caperni pieces. This is my first one, but like, so good. And all the girls are loving Caperni right now. Um, probably because of their fashion show in Paris that broke the internet with the spray on dress. Um, it was a thing, it was a moment. But this is so good because it's an eye catcher. Um, it's a conversation piece and it's definitely unlike anything I have currently in my handbag collection. I don't own any like zebra print things. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna style this up very quickly just to show you guys how I would style it. Um, and then we're actually gonna head off and do some shopping. I wanna see what's what. 
I mean, it is fashion week. I will be going to New York and Paris. I'm not trying to like spend a lot on just new things that I'll never wear again, but it's been a minute since I've been out amongst the clothes and I need to see what's what. And also a lot of places are having sales. So we're gonna go shopping today. But yeah, make sure to check out Farfetch. I will link this bag down below in the description box along with a few others from Caperni and just things that I'm loving that I think will be great for fashion week or really just any time of year. Um, down in the description box from Farfetch, you can use my code. You can check all of those things out. All right guys, so the first way I style this beautiful Caperni bag is with this full Zara look. <laughs> it's a Zara crop top and a long Zara maxi skirt. I got this skirt when I was in Paris during Paris Fashion Week and I love it. You guys love it too. Um, I'm not sure if any of these things are still available but I'll link similars from Zara down below. Um, and then for the shoe, I paired them with these butterfly um, Sophia Webster uh, heels. You guys love these and I think the butterfly on the heel matches um, the purse perfectly. This is definitely more of like an evening look um, because it's really cold <laughs> in New York right now and I don't know if I would be able to pull this off unless it was like a nighttime event and I had on a big coat and then I take it off once I get inside but very kind of like an evening look uh, with this bag. I kind of dressed it up with a heel and with an all black look. Okay guys, so next up, if I wanted to do something more casual and street, I would go with something like this Y Project shirt. This is probably the coolest shirt I've ever gotten. I think I, I believe I bought it at Essence or maybe even Farfetch. Um, I'll link it down below, it also comes in white. You can actually wear it as a t-shirt or <laughs> it comes with a little string in the back and strings for the arms and you can wear it as just something that's on the top which i think is really really cool and then i just put my hair up for emphasis um and then i paired it with my favorite margella slash denim jeans love these and then my loewe black bubble sandals so really like anything with black or if you were or, or if you are wearing one whole monochrome look, like an all yellow look, this would pop. Or anything with black and white, this would pop. An all black look, this would pop. An all blue look. If you're wearing top to bottom one color, this would work with any outfit. It's basically a neutral. But I love how <laughs> this look came together. It's very cool, very edgy, kind of street, fun. Um, and this just adds a little pop. Um, of course, I wouldn't wear this to New York or Paris Fashion Week in the winter because it's too cold. But most of my winter clothes are in uh, New York. So you'll be seeing what I'll be wearing for the Fashion Weeks soon. But this is how I would style it um, for here. So yeah, you will be seeing this quite a bit during both Fashion Weeks. So shout out to Farfetch for partnering with me. Um, make sure to use my code for a discount and check out the description box for terms and conditions but i love this bag i already know i'm going to be wearing this like it's it's happening i have quite a bit of cocktail parties and things for new york fashion week so with all my little black looks this will be great all right all right guys so i also wanted to show you a little something that i got in from dior look at this packaging Oh, this is so cool. Um, this is from their latest collection. So this is from their Mitza collection and I love the packaging. Everything is like cheetah. So good. So let me show you all what I got. Like this packaging is impeccable. Um, when you order things from Dior Beauty, this is how they're going to come. Like stunning. Um, there is a little Christian Dior. And everything is uh, like leopard print. This is just like a little bag that you can use for traveling, which is really cool. I ordered a few things. You all know I'm working with Dior in the next few months. So I wanna show you all everything that I've ordered so far. And look at this, this packaging is impeccable. 
Um, okay. First up, I got the Dior uh, Dior Show 10 Colors. I believe this is an eyeshadow palette. Let me show you. And I'm loving their eyeshadow palettes. I just did a get ready with me using their eyeshadow palettes. But the packaging on the Mitsa collection is so good. Um, this, is a, this is the 001 Mitsa Edition um, Dior Show Eye Palette. Now, for the colors. Ugh. The colors are so pretty. They're like perfect for spring, to be honest. And I'm really loving, of course, like the browns. These are great. And the pinks, they're a little shimmery. Um, just great for spring. So everything I get, I'm just gonna put in here. Starting with that. And I'm loving that uh, like leopard cheetah print. Super cute. Next up, I got another fragrance. This is how their fragrances come. And like this little round um, case here. This is the Amber Nui or um, Amber Night. And I love anything that smells like amber. Um, I already have their Bois d'Argent fragrance. And that one is one of my favorites. But I do love anything with amber in it. So I went ahead and got this one. So you just twist off the cap like so. You have the perfume here. Uh, I want to spray it. I have um, a little travel one, a little travel size of this in the discovery kit that I got. Um, and I use it all. So I wanted the bigger version. Oh, it smells so good. Ooh, it's like a very strong amber, very pretty amber scent. Love this. I'll link this down below. Um, what else did I get? You always get a free gift with purchase. So the gift that came with my purchase was a Rouge Dior lipstick in color 999. Um, it's just a mini lipstick. And I think you get to choose which gift you get with your purchase. So yeah, it's just like a super cute mini lipstick. This is their infamous red, which I really like. Um, so that's the free gift with purchase. Comes with this cute little Christian Dior pouch that you can use while like traveling. I'll put my lipstick in there. They're always giving you little extras, which I really like. Um, oh, and I got this too. Was this a free gift? This is from their holiday collection. It's just another Dior little like travel bag. bags they're so good for traveling you can put your makeup in there um your i like to put my cords for all of like my electronics when i travel in these little bags because they're so easy super cute and then of course everything was laid out nicely on this little christian dior pillow <laughs> and I, what i do is i put these in my room okay my battery died <laughs> but like i was saying what I do with this, these little pillows from Dior that come in all of um, your beauty um, deliveries, I put this in my room and I put all of my jewelry on top at the end of the night. Um, they're just a really cool little fun pillow. I love it. Um, so I do have a code with Dior. It is Monroe23, all capital letters, for a free gift with purchase over $125. And that is good up until March. The, the last day in March, the first three months of the year. So yeah, check it out. I will link all the, of these things down below. And if you order now, I believe you will get this packaging from the Mitsa collection, which I think is really cool. I got my Amber Nui and I got my brand new eyeshadow palette. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got in new from Dior Beauty. All right guys, I'm gonna get myself together because I wanna go to Curio by Faina um, Bazaar to see if they have anything that would be good for me for Fashion Month. Um, and then I'm gonna head to Bald Harbor as well. 
I would like to go to the Webster see if they have anything. Um, so today is like a, we gonna see if anything is out there today. And of course, I'm gonna take you guys with me. I have some pineapple juice from Carrot Express. It's so good. I don't really indulge in a lot of sweets, but when I do, I love like, all right, y'all, my battery died again. <laughs> but I was just speaking about how um, when I do indulge in sugar, most of the time it's like fruit or fruit juices and such. I mean, every now and then, girl will eat like some cookies and donuts and cake and, but few and far between. This is so good. Okay, it's 82 degrees today, it is very hot. Like immediately when you step outside, you start sweating. Um, and it's February, gosh, I love that for me. So to go shopping, I'm wearing this Dries dress that I just got in from Essence. I'll link it down below if any of you are interested. But it's like very kind of sheer and floaty. It doesn't stick to my body. It's a like very super light, gauzy fabric. So I know I'm not gonna sweat. I mean, I still wanna look nice because I'm probably gonna end up going to Makoto for an early, for a late lunch, early dinner. I just pop my hair up in this little, I'm gonna have to wash my hair tonight because this has no definition, <laughs> which is fine. Um, I don't want to wear a heel, but that's like all of that. It's all of that. So I'm probably going to end up going with my clear Bottega heels since they go with everything and they're fairly comfortable. I can walk around all day. And I'll just pair it with my Chanel sandbag. Ooh, or should I do this one? No, I'll do the sandbag because you guys can at least fit in here. And they kind of go with these. So that's going to be the look for my little shopping excursion today. Even though I want to wear flats so bad. I'll show you the full look and then we're out of here. All right, guys. So I changed into this dress instead because I really want to wear flats today because I, I want to do... I want to really be able to look and shop and not worry about my feet. Um, even though most of my shoes are really comfy, I wanted a flat. So I changed into this dress from ALC. I've had it for years. You've definitely seen me wear this before. It's just a ribbed, um, like a halter dress almost. It's very comfortable and it's beautiful like uh, lilac. Um, and then I'm gonna go with my Chanel um, denim uh, flats, the dad sandals that kind of have like the same purple in them and my Chanel bag. So that's going to be the look. I already put on a fragrance which is Byredo Ball d'Afrique mixed with Tay Noir 29 and I'll link both of those down below. All right guys so here is the full look. I mean, I know people don't really care for the dad sandals, but they are comfortable and they'll get you through. They really will. Um, I just called my car. It'll be here in a moment. I think we're just going to head straight to Ball Harbor because I have more stores there that I think will have winter things like Neiman Marcus and Saks. Um, and I think Curio will just have mostly a curated collection of like beachwear. So let's go.
Vlog. Um, when I last left off, we had gone to Ball Harbor Shops to try and find something for Fashion Week. Um, as soon as I got there, I went straight to Makoto a restaurant because I was starving. I ended up getting the crispy rice with tuna. That is my favorite thing on the menu. It is so good. I also get this uh, salad that has crab and cucumber. Um, it's really, really good as well. I tried a new cocktail. Um, I didn't really like that very much. And then I got some fried rice. It was delicious. Walked around, checked out a few places. I did get something from Intermix. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Um, today, I'm actually getting back into the swing of like shooting uh, campaigns and things. My girl, Maria, Bella Rosa uh, blog, she's coming over to help me shoot. Um, so yeah, I did get something from Intermix. This is not even anything that I would probably wear to Fashion Week. It's a dress. I'll show it to you. i actually try it on for you too. Um, this is from the brand ALC, which was the same brand that I wore to go shopping. Um, it's just a plain black razorback uh, midi dress. It has no slit. Um, and this is just because I have a lot of house dresses like this, but I wouldn't necessarily wear this outside. And so I need just a throw on dress when I need to like go to the mailbox or run an errand. Something that isn't so like intricate, like most of my clothes, a lot of my clothes are very intricate and they deserve a look, a shoe, a bag. Um, and I just need something super plain. So I ended up getting this dress. So yeah, I'll definitely link this down below if anyone is interested. I did, however, get a package in uh, yesterday from L'Agence. 
it's a French brand. I mean, I hope I'm saying it correctly. Um, but I'm going to their New York Fashion Week show, I believe, or their presentation. I mean, they reached out a little while ago to send me a few things. So let me show you uh, what they sent. All right, guys. So this is the brand um, La Jance. I believe that's how you pronounce it. How cute is this wrapping paper with their stamp all over it? Um, so I believe they sent me a dress and a coat. So let's take a look. Oh, yeah, they did. I did pick this out. It's been a little while since I told them what I wanted, so I couldn't remember. But they sent me this beautiful dress. Is it a dress? Is it a halter dress? How'd it go? This is a bag. Oh, yes, okay. So this is the dress. It's so beautiful. It's like one shoulder. Um, and it's an asymmetrical dress and it's beautiful brown color this is really stunning i have a few cocktail parties to go to so maybe i'll take this to new york for new york fashion week and i love the detailing there on this again i'm gonna insert cutouts for you guys with me trying on all of these things but i think this is a silk satin fabric this is beautiful i have it in a size medium so yeah and I'm pretty sure this comes in another color too. So we have that. And definitely gonna take this to New York because I don't have like many coats. And this is like a wool moto jacket. It's really cool, it has gold detailing. I got it in a large because I like for my jackets to be a little bit oversized. I have broad shoulders and I like to not feel confined when I'm wearing things underneath the jackets. This does have padded shoulders. It has a little zipper on the pocket or on the wrist there. Um, yeah, and it has like an asymmetrical zipper, zippers on the pockets and a little buckle down at the bottom that you can adjust. And it's in this kind of like blush nudie color. Yeah, very cute. I could definitely wear this like over that black ALC Razorback dress or something like that. Um, this will be good for New York on like a, a not so cold winter day <laughs> or maybe even in the fall. So these things I'm definitely gonna take. So shout out to them for sending this over. And yeah. So I'm about to shoot, Maria just told me she's here. Um, and she brought her assistant as well. We're gonna shoot these pieces back here. Let me go over this. Um, so I'm shooting a campaign for Michael Kors. Um, I'm not sure if it'll be up by the time this video is, but probably. Um, they have like a new spring collection and I will be promoting that. And so I'm doing kind of like a get ready with me for like a Valentine's Day, Galentine's Day date. Um, like real uh, that's like the concept in my mind i'm going to be wearing this stunning razorback uh pink dress from michael Kors. it has a little hidden zipper there no slit it's a beautiful fabric and like the pink is like the perfect pink and it's the perfect length and just a little bit sexy with the razorback like that um and then i'm going to pair it with this coat they had a different coat um it was kind of similar to the jacket I just showed you, but it was leather. Um, but I wanted to try something a little different. So this is definitely giving 80s to me, like this jacket. Um, it has a zipper, like so. But what I like is that here in the waist, you can cinch it in with these drawstrings and it gives it like an hourglass shape. So I think this on top of the, um, the dress would be really cool. It also has a hood. Um, so yeah. And then I got a bag to go with the look. This bag is very similar to the Caperni bag from Netaporter. I mean, from Farfetch. Yeah, so this bag is, I mean, it gives the same vibe of this bag from uh, Farfetch. By the way, um, let me give you my code to Farfetch because I do have it. So the code is 10MS 
ms Monroe steel all capital letters 10 ms for 10 percent off at farfetch on um for new customers on full price items so definitely check out farfetch shout out to them for sponsoring this video but it gives the same vibe like it's the this is more zebra and this is more well what giraffe <laughs> it took me a minute to think about what animal print this was. But yeah, this is from Michael Kors and it's so cute. It's like a pony hair and it's black and white. It has a double chain, which is very cute. The chain is in black. And then like, look at this symbol. I love how they updated their uh, logo. It's super cute. And it's a good shoulder bag. Very cute. I'll be sure to link all of this stuff down below too. Um, and then I also, of course, they're known for their watches, so I got a watch to round out the look. A big face watch. I love big face watches and I love gold. And then finally for the shoe, these I'm very excited about. These are patent leather. And it has the same symbol on the toe. And they're like a nice sandal with a double ankle strap. So that should go really nice with the look you can come in here okay so that's what i'll be shooting for them um and then i'm just shooting some christian dior stuff but i already showed you guys the christian dior stuff but maria's here so now I ha why are you being shy i'm like i'm gonna come through they know you Maria's here and now I have to get to work because she has a busy day and I'm not ready. And Maria's assistant. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah. Look at Maria having a, I need an assistant. All right, we finished up with Dior. I'm wearing this Hanifa dress. So beautiful, I think it's still available. Um, pretty much my whole face is Dior. Dior eyeshadow, Dior show mascara, Dior lip, this is their signature lip, 999. I love it. So be on the lookout on my Instagram. Um, now we're gonna get into the Michael Kors. Behind the scenes. Dior Beauty campaign. I had on this beautiful Hanifa dress and we just did a bunch of different photos and videos to use for reels, for TikToks, for carousels. Um, the more content you have, the better. So you can really create a bunch of different things. So we started with that. I already showed you the pieces I got in from Christian Dior. They're all linked down below. You can use my code Monroe23. 
Um, and then after that, we went ahead and shot my Michael Kors campaign, which came out so good. Like those pieces from the outfit, I ended up putting together and just created the most bomb outfit. And I'm loving these patent leather heels. They are so comfy, so cool. I'm loving the MK they have on the front here. I really love the new design of the logo. It's really cute. And then that pony hair, uh, giraffe print um, bag, and that beautiful form-fitting pink dress. That, that dress fits like a glove. I'm definitely taking that dress to me um, with New York to New York. Um, I think it also comes in black. I'm wearing a medium. I'll link it below. That beautiful black jacket that cinches in in the waist with the hood. Everything. I love that entire Michael Kors look. So it should be up on my Instagram soon. You can head over there. Drop your girl three pink hearts and a comment to let me know you came from this video. Um, after that, we shot uh, this Attico mini dress that I have. I've had this dress for a while. I actually, actually wore it in Paris. Um, I, I wore it to a party and it was really a really fun party but I never took pictures in the dress so I wanted to get some photos I wore it with these stunning Karen Millen boots y'all know I love Karen Millen I worked with them all last year the boots are super comfortable very affordable I'll link them down below and then my new Caperni bag from Farfetch use my code 10MS um, and then finally we shot this dress, which is another Georgia Harding dress. You would have seen this previously. I have it in a beautiful brown color. I have it in a mini version in orange. Um, this one I'm wearing a size four. It fits really well. I thought it was quite see-through. It has like ruching on it. It's really pretty. Yeah, and a lot of you told me that um, the designer was on like Project Runway, like Britain edition. I didn't know that actually. So yeah, I took a few photos and videos around the house in this dress. So now I'm gonna clean up because my house is a mess after shooting and I'm starving. I don't know if you can hear my stomach growling, but it is. This Dior lipstick, so good. This is the color 999. It has kind of like an orangey undertone. It's super bright and beautiful. But I'm starving and I want pizza. Like, it is what it is. Your girl wants pizza. I've been trying to eat well, but I have been working out like with my bike rides, like paired with my working out. And the fact that I don't eat very often, like I usually don't eat breakfast. Um, your girl is burning mad calories and not replacing them. So I'm always kind of hungry now. So I need like filling meals. Um, and I want pizza, I do. So I'm about to go get some pizza. Um, I'm gonna sit out and work and eat at the same time. I'm gonna take my little uploader, this little SD card reader. This is the best thing ever. You just, all of my photos and videos that we just took, they're on this card. I'm gonna pop them on here. And then I'm gonna pop this right into my iPhone and upload everything and get to like, editing and things because most of these things are like due like today <laughs> really on Monday so yeah that's what we are going to do um and then I'll come back here and we'll pack and I'll show you guys a little bit of what I'm packing for New York um I, I have a lot of my clothing already in New York like my winter clothes but I'm just going to take just a few things from here that I think I might wear um, and we will pack and then we will start a brand new vlog that will be kind of like the first few days of fashion week. Even though fashion week doesn't really start until like February 10th. Um, I have so many events that I'm doing starting tomorrow in New York. So I want to start a new vlog. And I also want to show you my new equipment that I will be using during New York fashion week. So that'll be in the next vlog. All right. I'm gonna change clothes and we will head out. I'll be sure to link this thing, this little uploader down below. I get a lot of questions about how I do that. So I have um, I have Lightroom app on my phone. So I just edit all of my photos on my phone and then if I need to, I'll airdrop them to my computer. All right, let's clean up. And then uh, let's go get something to eat. I'm starving.
All right, guys, so we're gonna go get something to eat because I am starving. I'm back in this ALC dress that I just got in from Intermix. Just a throw on and go type of look. And I put on my Louis slides. Um, I'm gonna go find some lunch. I'm gonna spray on a little bit of the Barreto Ball Freak, one of my favorites. And yeah, I was having a chat <laughs> with like some friends and I realized I need to go out more. Like not just going out to like dinners and like work events and things, but I need to like be out where the men are. Um, because I'm a Taurus, I'm a homebody, like I like being at home and I just wish a man could just manifest himself like into my like living room. <laughs> So hard to meet people these days uh, if you're not on the apps you have to go outside and so I've been making a, con a conscious effort like I already meet people out especially when I'm like riding my bike I've met a lot of like new bike friends and men when I'm out like on the boardwalk or just in the street riding my bike but other than like work events and like dinners and things I need to start going out more by myself like I used to um, I, I have no problem going to the movies by myself, going shopping by myself, going to a five-star restaurant and sitting down and having dinner by myself. I do that quite a bit, um, but I haven't done it in recent months because all of the things I'm doing are like work things, so I just don't do that outside of that. So I'm getting back into that. I'm going to go sit and have lunch alone um, while like my makeup is already done and I feel cute and I look cute. And we're going to see what happens, y'all. We gonna see. I mean, your girl is out here. I'm trying. All right, let's go. Mm -hmm. 